today's video I will show you how to make this tree tri triangle shawl and you can find the free written pattern on my website. I will put the link in the description below. Make a slip knot. And chain six. Now we start in the fourth chain from the hook. Start with a single crochet. Double crochet in the next chain. And a treble crochet in the next, our last chain. Yarn over twice. Insert your hook in the next chain. Pull up a loop. Now we have four loops on our hook. Yarn over. Pull the loop through the first two loops. Three loops now on our hook. Yarn over. Pull through two loops. Two loops left. Yarn over. Pull through both loops. Our first triangle. This is how we make all triangles. We increase every even row by making an extra triangle in the last triangle. Chain 11. The fourth chain from the hook, single crochet, double crochet, and the treble crochet. And now flip the first triangle. And now we make a slip stitch in the chain space from the triangle of the previous row. And now we increase by making an extra triangle in the last triangle. Chain 6. Single crochet in the fourth chain from the hook. Double crochet in the treble and this is our second row, row one, row two. Chain eleven. the fourth chain flip over slip stitch chain six From now on, it's repeating row 2 and 3, till we have 16 triangles.
increase by making an extra triangle at the end of the row. Chain 6. Row 32. We work the row like we used to, but this time we will decrease at the end of this row and every even row by making a slip stitch in the last triangle instead of a wall triangle. And I see you at the end of this row. We are at the end of row 32 and now we have 15 triangles. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7... 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So, previous row we had 16 triangles and now we need 15. So we skipped the last one by making just a slip stitch. And this is how we decrease. Row 33. Just make the row like we did. And I'll see you at the end of this row. We're at the end of row 33. The last stitch. And now we have 15 triangles. Repeat row 32 and 33 till there is just one triangle left and I see you at the last triangle. I made row 59. So there are two triangles left. Now we will make row 60 or last row, chain 11. Make the triangle. Turn our work and now a slip stitch in the first triangle and a slip stitch in the second triangle. And that's it. Cut our yarn and weave in the end. And that's it. I hope you liked my video and see you next time. Bye!